We are all here in Atlanta to see the world premiere production of A Third Way here at Actors Express. Look at everybody who came. We are yeah. really excited. To yes. see this play that the Dell Shores Foundation helped fund. It's so exciting, yes? Yes. yes. Off we go. Okay. Uh, and now we're here with the actual creative team of A Third Way. Obviously, you all know Leah Sario. Hello. And this is director Lauren Emily Morris. Hi. This is so exciting. Tell our people how much you've enjoyed the process. It's been phenomenal. Just smart, smart, good-hearted, lovely, talented sexy. people. Sexy. Very sexy. sexy. Um, yeah, it's been very joyful. It's been, um, I, Actors Express is where I really started my journey as an actor and obviously now as a writer. And I could not imagine a better place to, to put this play on. A very Atlanta play in a very Atlanta theater. Mm -hmm. And we could not be more excited to have been a piece of this journey for all of you. A huge and this thing piece. that you have put into the world. Yeah. And I, I love that we got to start our process with y'all and with that reading. And it, it sort of means that we've been living with this play and with these characters for a long time. And that's, that's been lovely as well. There are so many queer writers in the South that don't get the recognition that they should. And Del Shores Foundation is doing their part to make sure that that changes very, very soon. Oh, we love all the advertisement. Excellent work. Here we are in the actual theater at Actors Express. Look at the third way set. Look at our crowd. There's the lead from the end. Dale and company and Jim. Look, we're all represented. We're at intermission of a third way and it's going so well. So good. Isn't it? Yeah. It is truly, I mean, truly, truly a stunning pattern. You know what's really wonderful? But everything's wonderful. The writing's wonderful. All of the acting is wonderful. But there is an understudy on tonight and it's fantastic. And it's his first time. And I love pace. You know, I love pace. And this pace is so good. And it's so queer, y'all. Oh my God. Aggressively, delightfully, modernly queer. Yes. Yes. We're so proud of everything everybody involved in this beautiful production. Also, we don't want to give it away, but the first act ends with one of the funniest, like, physical theater gags I have seen in a very long time. Literal gags. Um, everybody went to intermission cackling. And throwing up. Uh -huh. Come back. <laughs> act two. Our exclusive VIP after party with this amazing cast of this play. Look at these people. It's so exciting to watch. I want to say a huge word of thanks to Dell and to Emerson and to everybody with the Dell Shores Foundation. I know some board. Who are all our board members? Here. Yeah. Because it's very important to me as a Southern theater artist and as a queer theater artist to see this devotion to Southern queer storytelling and to show the different kinds of stories that exist within our very complex experience of being Southern and being queer at the same time. The fact that Dale and the Foundation are doing such marvelous work to promote these stories that live at these very um, uh, contemporary intersections where we all are living is really meaningful to me. And if you're in this room, that means you're supporting their work. And by extension, that means you've supported our work. And I am very grateful to each and every person here who's made that happen. But I do definitely want to say, it's been a blast over the last year getting to know Dell and Emerson. Uh, Dell and I had met previously a little, a little while ago. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but to be getting to know them and working with them this season has uh, just been Amazing, and I'm so glad that we're in each other's orbit now. This team, Lee, Lauren, the yeah. cast, I mean, yes. uh, the, the, the thoughtfulness and the care that went into this process uh, was really exciting. So thank you for being here. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Thank you to our beautiful artists for doing your beautiful yes. work. Yes. Choosing to tell this kind of story in this space with the reputation that you have is driving our community forward, and that's a choice that I know Aww. that you surely have gotten some pushback slightly from somewhere. <laughs> and that means a lot to all of us as a community and artists that you stand up and stand forward and put our stories this far forward. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. Yeah.
Lee and this amazing cast. It's so fucking good. So thank you, Lee, for this great story. I love how messy it is. I love how clear it is. I love, I love that it is, you know, I, I, I just wrote a lot of gay angst. And you are coming into a new world of this is... A, a, you know, a different way to think. So thank you for making us think and ma making us laugh tonight. We all yes. laugh. And, 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 and y'all, we, we <laughs> shed a tear or two. So you did your job. And so when is he going you. to Broadway? <laughs>